I got my start in wheelchair basketball back in 2007, 2008. When I went to Walter Reed, they they uh, pushed me to go do basketball as like a form of therapy so that I can uh, learn to move on and learn that uh, life wasn't over after losing like things that I did have before and to just keep pushing forward with life. Coming to UTA, um, I had a good friend of mine, me and him had been playing basketball for a while together and uh, he had uh, told me about UTA and how uh, the level of play out here was really intense, the, uh, the coaching's really good. And, um, it's just like, a, it would be a good next step to uh, getting to furthering yourself in the sport and uh, learning more about it and uh, meeting, also meeting some great people that uh, just love the sport. Future plans for me include uh, hopefully trying to go play basketball overseas, um, continuing on to play, hopefully maybe making it to the USA, USA team, um, fingers crossed. But uh, yeah, it's just uh, to keep playing basketball, use, use what I learned here to go on and coach uh, kids to teach them uh, what I've learned here and to keep furthering the sport of basketball. I look up to my dad. Uh, he's been a, been a strong figure in my life. Like he's a, he's a retired Navy vet. Um, I'm a Marine myself, uh, so I followed his footsteps in the military. He, uh, he, was, a, he was also the uh, CEO, by, uh, well, vice president of a company that he helped start and brought it up from the ground to be like one of the best, one of the biggest uh, real estate companies in the area I was growing up. So he showed me that uh, perseverance and hard work get you whatever you want in life. So use his example and I just keep pushing and try to try to mimic his, his work ethic as much as I can. Um, that and my mom as well, it's kind of corny I guess to say my parents but uh, my mom and my dad have both showed me what what it's like to be a good good person and a hard worker so I look at them I look up to them a lot to uh, for examples on how to live and in terms of advice for anyone I would say uh, don't let anything get you down like uh, if you can learn anything from uh, us the wheelchair basketball team or any wheelchair basketball player for that matter is that no matter what you think you have going on like you can always go above and beyond and uh, life's never, it, it might, it might, life might get tough, but there's no, you're never out. You just have to dig deep and find that personal strength to keep pushing forward and everybody has that.